Engineers Without Borders is going to Marumba, Rwanda to build rainwater catchment system onto a church. And we're also going there to continue our fuel briquetting projects that we've been working on since 2005. To me, the mission of Engineers Without Borders is really a symbiotic relationship between the students who learn about sustainable engineering and communities over there trying to build their infrastructure. I really do believe that people need help and I believe that I can do something to change their lives. An important thing to remember is while we go to this awesome university with all these awesome resources, there's, there's way more out there. You need to make sure the entire world has clean, fresh drinking water. I guess the big problem with that is why isn't it being done? How do we get people motivated to, to care about these other people? I, I guess, I don't know, just getting people to think about people other than themselves, I say that's, that's a really big challenge. Muramba, c'est une petite région située dans le district de Ngororero. Il n'y a pas beaucoup de routes, il n'y a pas de routes praticables qui mènent ici. Quand les ingénieurs euh, sans frontières sont venus ici la première fois, la route, cette route était très, 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 très difficile. Ils sont venus dans la région au moment où beaucoup d'ONG vraiment ne venaient pas à Moramba. En 1990, la route était en train d'être faite et puis la, la guerre a commencé. The genocide of 1994 was kind of like the final fallout of um, the ethnic hostility and animosity that had been brewing since the first colonization of Africa by the Germans and then by the Belgians. Ces intérêts à moi dont nous parlions sont venus ici. Ils ont demandé aux enfants de se séparer. Ils ont demandé aux Hutus de se mettre à part et aux Tutsis de se mettre à part. Mais nos filles, comme elles ont été éduquées à être ensemble, elles ont refusé. They said, please, we are Rwandese. There is no difference between Rwandese. And then because the students doesn't want to be separated, there's people, they keep them on this, on this side. This is the difference. Dormitory is one, second dormitory is third one, fourth one, fifth one. On les a tués, vous savez, on a tué ici 17 Jeune fille. As an Engineers Without Borders team, we don't affiliate ourselves with political situations, but it's very hard to, to know. I think he was.
Il y a eu le génocide qui a laissé beaucoup, beaucoup, beaucoup d'enfants, beaucoup d'enfants orphelins au Rwanda. Many people want to study in the high level, but the problem is no man. If you don't have the money, then you don't go to the school. And if you don't go to school, then you're kind of out and about all day doing whatever you wish. For those who don't have parents, it is difficult to give something to eat. For those who have parents who suffered from AIDS, it is also a problem. They have to drink water from a tap that, you know, how many other villagers use and might not necessarily even be safe for them. They don't always have food. They don't have the, the strong nuclear family that I had the benefit of growing up with. They rely on the, the charity of the church, of other people to survive. You know, this is something that I never even had to worry about, let alone deal with. The school, well, can't Le venir à la BBC et aide les enfants et avoir une autre idée sur le travail ou bien sur les pratiques. So we only need to get the cement. cement and, mm -hmm. Is it the sand, sands and gravel are here? Yes. Okay. Local, yeah. Do they need all the money up front? Uh, the full? Or can we give them half the beginning or? We pay the constructor after. After? We can, we can okay. pay this after. That's after. The Wisconsin group have had several implementation trips and each trip kind of builds on the past trips. The project that we had in 2005 it increased water that was going to taps in the area. This time we've worked to get the rainwater collection installed on the front of the church there. The most important thing here in Muramba is to make the water all over. Now the line that we have, the inhabitants are in the water. Alors, l'autre tio qui va à l'autre côté pour que veille la stèle pour aller à l'autre stèle des autres citoyens, c'est brisé. <rire>